afternoon, everybody. This is Karen Marge from Hilton Head Island, South Carolina. And this is Freedom the Parrot. And this is actually his second visit to the Reptile Lagoon. And in the background, we have the American Alligators. And this is a spectacular display. And what's interesting is when the alligators are young, they're going to maintain the two colors that you see, the dark and a little bit lighter um, horizontal striping. And, you know, alligators can actually survive on just 90 pounds of food a year. And the sad part is, um, when they're young, every type of mammal out there and other reptiles will eat a small alligator. And alligators are actually ectothermal, so that means they're going to match uh, whatever the air temperature is, they'll maintain that. And that's why in the sunshine they've got to soak up um, the rays because they have what's called, what's kind of like acts like a solar panel um, on top of their body. And these bony plates um, are called scoots. And this is amazing. So I'm at the Reptile Lagoon up here. It's south of the border. It's between South and North Carolina off I-95. And last year we were lucky enough to film and I didn't know I was going to be in here three and a half hours last year. It's just amazing. All right, everybody, we're signing off live with American Alligator and Freedom the Parrot at the Reptile Lagoon. Have a great day.